Good morning guys, today is May 5th, 2018 and it's time to get aesthetic. So today we are going to be doing a full day of eating. I'll be going throughout the entire routine of what I've been doing pretty much on the weekdays um, as to what I'm eating. Now I might incorporate the refeed days um, but today I'm going to be showing you guys exactly what I'm eating for breakfast, exactly what I'm eating for my meals, what the macros are, what the calories are, and my total caloric intake at the end of the day. Okay guys, meal number two here. So we got one entire cucumber cut up and salted. That's going to be roughly about 20 calories or so. This one here, we got a cup of raspberries, frozen raspberries, 70 calories. It's going to be about 20 grams of carbs, um, roughly 5 grams of carbs, really nothing at all. Uh, this one is digestive carbs. This is also digestive carbs. Um, complex carb would, Complex carbohydrates would consist of bread, rice, pasta, those types of carbohydrates. So these are great sources. This has a little bit more sugar, obviously, but healthy sugars. Um, this will consist of just a little snack pretty much <laughs> uh, for now. You can see my hair is a little different. I did have to record this later on. Uh, I am, uh, I did record my morning, which you guys already saw. Uh, I've been having that every single day. So it's, you guys know the joy it was, it's the oats, it's the egg whites, it's the black coffee. Always been having that 15 dark chocolate chips. It's always been my routine and I love it. So this is my snack. For, so this is meal number two. Um, my meal number three is going to be, you guys will see in a sec here, but it's going to incorporate for my next two meals after that. So I'll show you guys in a bit here. Um, I'm going to dig into this. It's super good. We're roughly about 10 days out now. Okay guys, so yes, this is meal three, four, and five. Now the reason why that meal is three, four, five is because I have three of these meals. Now that's three chicken breasts, uh, one entire pack of frozen vegetables that spread throughout all three. I also cook some extra chicken for the next day. I kind of like to cook my meats prior to make things a little bit easier because it does take longer to cook. So I kind of cook meat roughly about for the next three days in total, and then I cook more meat. Um, so yeah, three chicken breasts. Now, I'm also going to have a protein shake later on today. Um, if I get a little bit more hungry, I'll have another cup of raspberries and raspberries. Berries. You guys get the idea. <laughs> and um, another cut salted cucumber. So my salt levels are fairly high. Um, just kind of keep my fullness, help me get a pump in the gym. Um, drinking tons of water. I got about a liter. So this bottle here. Holds about a liter. I drink about four of these, sometimes five, depending. Um, but on top of that, I'm also having BCAs in an entire liter bottle as well, or 800 milliliters um, as well. 
So a lot of water. BCAs I incorporate when I do my fasted cardio. Um, just kind of really depends on what's going on. But really, that's that's my full day of eating. I don't have much else to say. Um, if I do, you guys will see it later in this video. But if it isn't, um, so keep in mind, guys. Breakfast is the same throughout. It's about 300 calories. Three meals. Kind of, you could say, two snacks. So raspberries, up to two cups. Uh, cucumbers, up to two entire cucumbers, salted. And a protein shake. Mm, if I snack on anything, maybe a few almonds, but they can be high in calories, so I'm very careful as to when I do it. So if, it, if anything, it would be better before the workout so I can kind of utilize that as fuel. Um, ideally, I stay away from that, especially since I'm this close from the competition. But I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I mean, just explaining a little bit of my full day of eating. And before that, I'm actually going to show you. So this is the protein that I use. It's called here. Canadian protein. It's whey protein. It's very cheap. Uh, it doesn't cost much. I got a lot. It's it's very like you could buy wholesale. Um, I'm not endorsing it or anything. I just personally believe like I'm not getting paid to do this. I just personally believe that this protein worked the best for me. Um, I've been doing having this um, brand for a while now. It tastes really good. Um, I would have it with oats sometimes I just mix it up so it's like protein oats kind of tastes really good doesn't sound that good but trust me um tastes really good if you're gonna get this one I personally recommend the chocolate milkshake uh it's it's quality cheap doesn't cost too much I do live in Canada so it is a Canadian based company so it might be a little bit cheaper that's why but check it out guys um Canadian protein Search it up on Google. You guys will know where it is. Um, but I hope you enjoy. You guys enjoyed that video. Again, if you did, all you could do is just smash that like button down below. Um, if you want to check out some more videos, please subscribe. Turn the notifications on. I hope you guys enjoy this one. Once again, please leave a like below. Come subscribe and get a second.